charges against the woman at the center of a scrapbook squabble have been dismissed. A judge ruled this morning there was not enough evidence that Floyd Watson stole scrapbooks from a senior center. But it looks like Floyd's fight is far from over. News 13's Gabrielle Burkhardt is here with more. Dean Floyd and a group of supporters celebrated in court when they learned the case was closed. But this afternoon, we learned it may not be. Floyd Watson appeared in court this morning for her trial. She's charged with stealing scrapbooks from the Tijera Senior Center back in January and banned from the center by the village. We have no case report, we have no witness statements, we have no video, we have absolutely nothing from the prosecution side. A Bernalillo County deputy couldn't provide any evidence of Watson stealing the scrapbooks. Okay, and don't the rules require all that? That is, and um, we agree with the move to dismiss. Okay. Then at this time, what I'll do is, is grant the dismissal without prejudice. I feel somewhat vindicated, but I wish Doris could have been here. The judge said Watson can return to the senior center. She and her friend Doris Lark were accused by the village of stealing scrapbooks that Lark insists she created and paid for. Lark died before her trial and her case was dismissed. I'm glad it's over, but I'm going back to the senior center and if they want to have me kicked out, arrested or anything, okay because I am going back. I'm going to be with my friends. But after court, the village attorney sent this notice saying the no trespass order for Watson is still in effect. Watson's attorney wants to know why. The senior center didn't own one dime of those scrapbooks. So they had this information before they even filed these charges. That's how outrageous this case is. Now, the mayor has been dodging us for months, and today she finally spoke with News 13. We asked her why Watson is still banned from the senior center and about this case. Hear from the mayor tonight at 10. Back to you. All right, Gabrielle, thank you. Watson's attorney tells us there are potential grounds for a civil rights violation lawsuit in this case. And now the scrapbook squabble has spilled into the village council meetings. Council members were quoted in the local independent newspaper saying, they wanted the mayor to dismiss charges against Watson. One council member said the council was told historical pictures had been taken and thought the photos were from the 1800s. The mayor claims council members are throwing her under the bus, adding that she did not mislead the council. The council will discuss this case at their regular meeting Monday at 6 p.m.